Uh, where's... You are watching Mimosa Coal. Hello, you're watching Mimosa Coal. Uh, this is the video after those depressing videos about the two week notice. Thought I'd, um, you know, kind of jazz it up a little bit, you know? Um, yeah, I was actually doing this video with the same premise, but um, you know, the delivery was really short. And like I was at the door for like three minutes and like I was just gonna leave the I left the video on you know like I usually do so I'm like you know what I'm restarting I didn't even get that into it so um, the video is actually about this horchata right here look how big this horchata like this is a 32 ounce thing like that's so huge it's like bigger, it gotta be bigger than a large, like a large cup of McDonald's, right? 32 ounces. I don't know. It's just so much horchata. But the reason I got this was because 16 ounces is not big enough. Like, um, I don't know, I'm, I'm coming back from a delivery right now, but I was coming back from a delivery, like, um, Coming back from a delivery, uh, not this delivery, but the one before it, and you know, thought I go to this Mexican place I was on the way that's got a drive-through, which is super nice. More Mexican places need drive-throughs, and like, yeah, 16 ounces, never enough. But then 32 ounces was only one dollar more, and like, yeah, okay, that's fine. You get first 16 ounces, then you get the sex, the second 16 ounces half off basically so i'm like fuck yeah i'm doing that but um we're back already the delivery was just literally two minutes away like that's what i saw on the gps but uh, i'll cut to the chase because it's kind of busy right now um if i got one in the future maybe to share with a friend or maybe uh, a lover um of some sort maybe I would do that, but just on my own, it's just too much. I'm like, guys, you need a 24 ounce before you start thinking about making a 32 ounce horchata, you know? 24 ounces would be perfect. If I had something in between like 16 ounces and 32, which I think in between is exactly 24, um, it sounds about right. Um, yeah, that would be fantastic. So if you ever open up a Mexican place, do, do that don't have like too small or too large like it's like that with the milkshakes at Portillo's you know I want something in between you know be the business that does that uh, or maybe I could just start my own business where uh, I buy these 32 ounce horchatas and I s like put them in two different cups I sell each of them full you know for the price of 16 ounces so I'd get a dollar for every two horchatas I sell. That would be a good idea too. You don't even need to start a Mexican business. You, I mean, you know, like a business that sells authentic Mexican food. You know, I, I eat Mexican business. That's what I meant, you know, Mexican food. Um, but yeah, just do that and you already have a business. And while you're selling hot dogs, just sell hot dogs and horchatas. I would really like that. Or even if at like a bar they'd sell horchatas. I wish they did that because they're so good. I love drinking them. Like I'm complaining about this is being too big, but I'm definitely gonna finish it. You know, like man, I've already put a pretty pretty big dent into it. Yeah, look at that. It's like the size of my head. I'm still drinking it though. I just don't hope it won't have to like will make me pee like right away or something you know that always sucks for deliveries when you have to really go to the bathroom um so fingers crossed uh i'm gonna get in there get a delivery and see you on the flip side